Okay, it's confirmation. 0.77 amps into the electromagnet. We have south face, north face, north face, south face. The electromagnet's too weak to register in comparison to the Neo, so shake up the mineral oil. Both leads show here. I'll show the field. Try that again. Try one more time. It's better film. So most of the activities a little bit above that magnet, not much going on there. Okay, so there it is. Again, confirmation of both leads attached. And I will flip them so that they are in a different mode. Okay, again, just to reiterate, we have. South, north, north, south. Okay, now the next video I will show is with the uh, bias mag magnets flipped. Okay, I have flipped the bias magnets. Again, we are at 0 0.77 amps into the electromagnet. North, or I should say uh, negative and positive. We have, should be south, north, and then south-north. So let's just double check it. South, north, south, north. North, okay. I will shake up the requisite mineral oil. And again, electromagnet is on both leads. And we will watch the field. There you go. Much, much different with the electromagnet. Can both leads are attached. So again, this is just to reiterate that one lead was not misplaced from my previous upload, so this is just a uh, redo as it were. So what we have here in example is the bias attract mode to the rotor versus the previous film where you have more of an electromagnetic interaction with the bias buck with the rotor. So again, what you're witnessing is the bias magnet in attraction mode to the rotor versus the previous film of the bias magnet in the bucking mode, for what it's worth. Again, this is just to clarify that it was not an aberrant um, utilization without any electromagnetic influence and or leads connected. Have a great night.